Howdy, y'all. Uh, we're doing eggnog today. This is uh, my buddy Money. He is extremely uncomfortable to be on camera. So we're going to have a lot of fun today. Uh, we're going to rate these guys blind taste tested. My wife's going to bring them in when we're not in here. And then you'll know what it is, of course. Price will be in the corner as always. And uh, let's get this thing going. Yeehaw! <laughs> All right, I'm sure y'all are wondering why I am talking in a southern accent and wearing this cowboy hat. I just got back from Texas and uh, went to Mexico and got this hat for $15. So we're going to move on. Um, so I don't know what the first one is. So I don't I don't really know what to say at this point. This is Money. I introduced him earlier. He uh, He's extremely charismatic, as you guys can tell. Um, and he does not like new things. He does not like any food that he doesn't know what it is. And more importantly, he doesn't eat meat if it has bones in it. So, uh, let's try it, buddy. Why are you so shy? I would like to know what it is. Yeah, and you hear kids flavors. in the background, that's because you can't get rid of children. You can't do it. How do you, how do you, so I, this, to me, if I had to guess, <coughs> this is Southern Comfort. If I know my eggnog, which I probably don't, this is Southern Comfort. What do you think, Bonnie? Uh, I think it's not the one I want. You don't like it? It's all right. All right. Aight is what we have for this one. Alright. On to the next. It looks like milk. Like, I like milk, but I, I'm not... There's some interesting ones in here that I'm, I'm not excited to try. Well, I'm not against trying. But, uh... Does this one remind you more of your past? My past? What do you mean? <laughs> I don't know what that means. This one don't smell as sweet. That's not eggnog. Bro, it's eggnog, but it's not right. Why would you tell me that? <laughs> now I don't want to drink it. Like, try it. It's good. Oh, uh, this is really eggnog, right? I know. Yeah, I know exactly which one it is too. It don't smell sweet whatsoever. <laughs> oh. I just want everybody to, at home to know. These are real reactions. <laughs> this is actually how he is in real life. Uh, this is not uh, something yeah. to put on. He he will not drink anymore. He's potentially going to throw up. I don't know what's happening. He won't even swallow it. You just literally just say what you just said. That it tastes like breast milk? Yeah. Yeah. I don't think you want... <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it does taste like breast milk, though. We both are fathers, so we've both experienced the love of a woman during uh, pregnancy. Damn. <laughs> and due to, due to that, we have, uh, during our love on, making, on, every on. once in a while, things happen, and you get stuff in your mouth, and it's not as bad as you think it is. God damn. Uh, rumor has it, some people use it in their coffee as a uh, creamer. But, I, I, I guess, I don't know. Just for clarification, this is eggnog, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, moving on to number three. I know what that last one was. I don't want to say it yet, but uh, this one is very egg colored. It looks like kind of egg yolky, if you ask me. Um, money, any thoughts? Nope. I don't like. I don't like something that smell. Oh no, that's it. That's that's. That's the good stuff. That's that's the promised land. That is the promised land. That's a lot better than titty milk. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Just my <damn>. damn. <laughs> <laughs> All right, number four. We have another watery one. So, uh, I mean, um, last one that was watery was compared to something interesting. So, we're gonna try this one. Hopefully it doesn't taste like that, because I'm here for eggnog and not that kind of milk. This one's a little sweeter. That is... What is that? That's Southern Comfort Vanilla, I oh, vanilla Ice. 
Vanilla Spice, I think is what it was. Oh, there's the Target brand too. This is a cheaper brand, but the taste is fine. It's just not as thick and creamy as it normally is. Number five. Why the hell is it? It smells funny. No, like, you didn't even smell it. it before you tasted it? Oh, it's good. Yeah. You. Stay gone. Yep. No, but, like, so it's a smell. What does it smell like? And don't just say eggnog. Uh, like, don't just smell like eggnog. <laughs> It tastes, it, sm it smells a little bit like eggnog and a little bit like something else. <laughs> That's awful, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> That's worse than the other. That's, that is a really bad eggnog. Why would you... I'm guessing that's oat milk eggnog. The other one that I said earlier I that I thought milk. I knew what it was, I'm pretty sure that's almond eggnog. If this is not either almond or oat milk eggnog, I'm freaking crazy because this is bad. And I never want it again. You just drink it. <laughs> I don't want to drink any more eggnog. <laughs> I want to drink this one. It looks like water. It oh, looks like this is the oat no, milk one. No. I, I was wrong. No, smell it first. Oh, that's the almond milk one. It's gross. The only person who's gonna like that is my wife because she doesn't do animal products. It smells like wheat. It smells like butthole. I'm... I don't okay. like it. Well, we I mean, it's not here. bad. It's like almond milk, but it's just freaking almond milk mixed with almond. It literally smells like, well, you Eggnog started. seasoning, I guess. I don't know. No, I don't like it. No. What? Wait. Quick. Never mind. You want to try mine? To the camera. It's just a round two of breast milk is what it is. <laughs> I wasn't trying to go there. <laughs> but thank you. I meant goat milk. Yep, that's booby milk. Here we are at number seven. It's another watery one. It's, I, I've never not wanted eggnog this much in my life. Um, you would think that when we're drinking just these like double shots, it's not, it wouldn't be that, it's not great. Anyway, here's number seven. It smells really good actually. I think it smells good, but I think it's gonna taste too sweet. You let me know. It's not, actually, it does. Okay, so this one, I know exactly what it is, and I've said that multiple times, but this one I for sure know exactly what it is. For sure, 100%. And it tastes like what it is with some sweetness. It, it's good, it just doesn't taste like eggnog. It you can't tell me it's not good and doesn't taste like eggnog. It's not not good, but it doesn't taste saying. like eggnog at all. It's good, it's just not eggnog at all. Like, it's honestly, it tastes just like coffee creamer. There we go. It's exactly what yeah, it tastes yeah, like. Like, uh, like, if I was to take a shot of coffee creamer, that's what it would taste like. And I'm okay with yeah, that. Yeah, like the coffee creamer or that, um, that milk stuff that's in the can. Yeah. You lose? I can't... No, no, I think I know what you're talking about. Are you talking about condensed milk? Yeah, there you go. That's it does taste like condensed milk. It, it does. It's good, though. I it mean... It would be a great air freshener. It's not what I was expecting, so it surprised me at the beginning, but I kind of like it, and it smells really, really good. Really good. It smells really good. <laughs> Woo! All right, here we are, number eight. We're finally nearly finished. Um... I actually didn't think that it's just it's just like the uh <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. Uh, and I don't wanna be here anymore. But uh here we are, number eight. And the uh 
I in, my, in the last video I did an apple cider, um, and I didn't think there were that many bad apple ciders. Um, I didn't think there were that many bad apple ciders, and there's a lot of bad eggnog, just like there's a lot of bad apple cider out there, and. I, I genuinely think that we're doing you a favor and, and trying these out because there's some terrible eggnog in the world. I, I think out of our list, we only had like four that we would buy. And uh, I'm getting felt up a little bit. Usually it's my wife doing this and I prefer her, but his big meaty hands are different than I'm used to. I kind of like them. Anyway, just my, my shoulders, nothing nothing else. Anyway, let's, uh, let's cheers to number eight. Oh, it smells like eggnog and looks like eggnog. Mm. That's good. Bubble it's good. Is. We have a visitor. Is. Hey, come here. <laughs> that actually right. tastes really good. Mm hmm. This one's good. This one's really good. Yeah, I like that. I don't know if it's a, because it's the last one, but this one might be my favorite. It's really good. You should have given me this every time. Mm-hmm. I'm okay with that. That's promised land. We have made it to the promised land. That's why it's last. They saved it for last because they knew, just like Moses, we were in the desert trying this terrible, terrible eggnog, but we've now made it to the land of milk and honey, the promised land. So we had a three-way tie between one, three, and eight because we can't remember when they're not right next to each other. So let's... The wiggle test, okay. <laughs> this one, this one wiggles, this one's thicker. This one's the thickest. This one is the thickest. Now, this one's the thinnest, which I'm gonna guess I don't like this one as much. Oh, wait. Which one did you try first? Eight. I tried eight? <laughs> which is interesting, I thought that would be. You've tried, <laughs> you liked all three of these. Oh no. That's old fashioned. That is, uh, that is good. I really like this one. I think that's three. One all day. Yeah, mine goes this way. Best, second best, third best. Third best. That one's your third best? Interesting. I, I get why though, because it has a, a, a flavor that is not eggnog in it. So, that's why that's why you don't like anything that's abnormal. You sure this is the right one? That one's one. That's the first one we tried. Kind of smell funny. All right, which is better out of the first and the last? All right, so. Money's gonna take another hour to decide which one of these three is his favorite. We'll come back to you in about two seconds with our favorites from top to bottom. I'm telling you, there are some you need to not freaking buy. Don't buy the ones I tell you not to buy. They're not good. And I don't think it's like a matter of opinion. I think I'm just right. They're crappy. All right, so I'm gonna tell you what I think was number, or first or last. So my favorite, I believe, if I'm correct, is number one. And um, I'm confident that number one, I thought it was the promised land, but I can see a little bit because I can see it. I think number one, fudge. I think number one is Southern Comfort. I think my second favorite was The Promised Land. Now, I believe I've had this before. I believe the last time I tried it, it was terrible. So I'm gonna assume that I don't like this one. Um, I don't love it, at least. So, The Light Eggnog, see, I think this is in the right place. Um, I know number five, had to be this, because I hate Highland, it's disgusting, it's really gross, this one's leaking. Um, this one I know exactly which one was, it's good, I'm just not ready. Light Eggnogs for bad people, I don't, I don't know who created Light Eggnog, but I know it's not right. So Light Eggnog, we're still gonna put you here, here. Um, this one, crap. That vanilla spice might have been the one I really didn't like. All right, how do you do? So number one was Promised Land. <laughs> and then your next favorite was three, which was the Southern Comfort. And then- So I just had those two swapped, all right. Yeah, eight is favorite day. I think you accidentally had that one in the right place. I don't think you moved that one at all. Yeah, but I knew it was there. <laughs> I was confident. Hey, so I, it's very obvious that good eggnog is not light eggnog, so there's that. Uh, then you had number four, which is the light eggnog. You got that one right. Then seven, oat milk. Then two, 
the vanilla spice. Oh my gosh, am I good. And then the last two you have switched around. Mm, yeah. I don't think so. so I think have... I may have them switched around on the list, but I, I know that I hated number five. But you might be right. But that, that Highland eggnog is, is terrible. Don't buy it. Don't buy it. It's, it's so bad. This might be the best coffee creamer in the world, but do not buy Highland eggnog. Mix it up. It's my turn. Okay, well, my number one favorite is going to go here. We got the number one. Number two, I believe, was this one. Uh, number three, I believe, was this one. You guys know this one. Uh, I'll be in order. Oh, uh, and then those. <laughs> you, you have to be going to say, like me, go say. Uh, this one looks even right. No? I don't know. <laughs> I don't think so. No? <laughs> All right. Um, How right was that? So your number one was actually the yeah the red bottle, the favorite day eggnog. It was not Southern Comfort. What? Um. And then hmm. your next one, number two you have right, is the Promised Land. Okay. And then three was the normal Southern Comfort. Really? The black label, yeah. Hmm. And then, then your number four was number four, which was the light eggnog, so the green one. Uh -huh. And then seven was your next, which is the oat milk, so... Wait, have the, I had this up in the top right? Yeah. And then two was the Vanilla Spice Southern Comfort. This? Okay. And then you had the Highland and then the Almond Milk. The Almond Nog. Well, yeah, fool me because I didn't think this was going to be my favorite one. I thought it was going to be between these two. Hmm. Well, you got me. Okay, so as you can see, we fast forwarded through the end of that because we were taking way too long to rate everything and guess where everything was. Um, at the end of the day, we found out that I am very good at guessing eggnogs. I only had two that were off and they were right next to each other. Money is not good at rating eggnog and he was very fooled by the, uh, the eggnogs. He didn't think he was gonna like the Target brand as much as he did. Um, but yeah, thanks for coming. Like, subscribe. We'll see you on the next one.